Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. And I'm Jen Jen, and we're gonna do a Stitch With Me video. Now I'm gonna tell y'all, I've been trying to record this video all morning. I tried on my iPad and it kept kicking me off. So I'm gonna keep my fingers crossed that my phone doesn't do the same thing. So anyway, I am doing Bountiful Bookshelf. And I did print off a picture that I had saved of the actual chart or actual picture of the what will it look like when it's done. This is it, as you guys can see. Now I am down in this section, like up in here. So um, I've been working from the bottom up. So right now I'm love, let's see. I'm kind of over here. I'm looking at my picture. I'm over in this little part over here. I'm on the edge of Pinocchio. But I'm really enjoying this one. Mind you, there's a lot of confetti um, in certain places, like right here, where the piece of paper is. Now, I've tried to zoom in, and I can't. I don't know why, and my phone won't let me. So, bear with me. But there was a lot of confetti here. So, and I'm, let me see if I can bring you closer without, you know, knocking um, this over. I don't know if that's going to work. Uh, well, dang it. Whoa. Don't fall. Hopefully, there. I hope y'all can see now. I'm sorry. I'm, but there's confetti here in this little section, but it is what it is. So, we're just going to get started. I have not done one in a while, and I wanted to do a stitch with me uh, just because, um, you know, like I said, it's been a while. I don't even know when the last time was that I did a stitch with me. I uh, didn't even bother to look it up. But, um, and I miss, you know, doing Stitch With Me's. And I feel kind of weird because I did one. I'm doing this one right after. Uh, right after, the day after a whipping chat. So, I'm going to try to figure out, um, you know, what day to do this on so that, you know, the two aren't back to back feels kind of weird i may do this you know film it and then schedule it to be uploaded for saturday who knows i yeah i mean if i do that you know i don't know we'll figure it out so anyhow i hope everyone is well um one reason i wanted to start doing stitch with me uh was because I do floss tube videos, but I feel like that's the only time people uh, can connect with me um, through the stitching community, besides on Facebook and Instagram. And it just feels weird because most of my videos are diamond painting. And I originally started this channel as, you know, floss tube. And so I kind of want to do half and half. So, we'll see how this works. I don't know. I'm, I need to get, um, what is it? The, um, I need to get something to write ideas down for channel, for my channel. So that, you know, because I was told yesterday that, um, I wasn't popular enough to listen to or watch. And this was, well, not watch, not listen. She, not that. She thought I, she likes my videos, but she felt that, um, I guess she was disappointed because I wasn't more popular than what I am. Which I, you know, I'm just going to be honest here, guys. 
truthfully, do I wish I was? Sure. Do I wish I had, you know, a thousand, you know, whatever subscribers? Sure. But I don't, I'm not stressing because to be truthful, I don't do it for the numbers. I do it because I like doing it. If that makes any sense to you. And no, you know, there are times that I'm not very consistent and I'm trying to change that. And um, I'm just, I, I don't know. So I don't, I don't know if it's the way I come across to people. I don't know. I'm trying, guys. I really am. So we'll see. So anyway. But yeah, I felt, I just feel like I haven't done one of these in a while. And I miss, you know, sitting here, stitching and talking and, you know, telling you guys what's been going on and so forth. So I'll figure it out. We'll figure out when to, you know, upload these and put it on and so forth. We will go, we'll go from there. So let's see, I'll start with reading. Yes, I have not been doing really well with re keeping up on my reading. Ugh. Guys, you just don't know. I had very, I had, I had good intentions. I, I will tell you this. Back in January, I made a basically a New Year's resolution to myself that I would, uh, you know, get back into reading and try to, you know read more and well <laughs> didn't didn't work out that way um so i'm i'm trying to get back into it i'm finding that um i'm do i'm listening to audiobooks more now don't get me wrong i you know yeah. audiobooks i love I mean, especially when I'm stitching, and I'm using my scissors the wrong way. Especially when I'm stitching. Um, you know, I um, I can sit here and stitch and put on, um, and still, you know, have TV on. Yes, I do that. And listen to a book while the TV's playing. I know some of you are like, why? That's just me because, you know, my kids do their own thing and they're, you know, my two boys are busy either uh, playing a video game or they're watching, you know, their own thing in their room or in my room because little dude plays his Xbox in my room, but um, that's usually you know, my thing. So I sit out here and I'm just not, I don't like being by, you know, I don't want to say I don't like being by myself, but being, sitting here in the quiet is just kind of weird for me. Don't ask me why. I don't know. I, it's just the way I am. Now, I wasn't always like that. I mean, I did, you know, didn't have a problem with reading in the quiet when I lived at home with my parents. Don't know what's different now. Um, I have no idea. And bear with me, I'm trying to find the next color. But um, it's just, I don't know what's different now than what, who knows? I, I, I don't, I'm, you know, I'm weird. Uh, I've been told I'm weird then you know I don't deny it because I am I'm weird my kids will tell you I can be weird so anyway I started listening to this book by Harlan Coben and he's he's a writer an author that you know I have kind of I I don't know I was kind of like, I've seen books of his and I was like, okay, you know, I, 
at first I wasn't kind of, at first I was kind of, you know, like, do I really want to read his books? And I, at the time I didn't think I was going to be interested. So I thought, okay, I want to read something different. And, you know, I like mystery books. I like, you know, suspense. And I, you know, just love those kinds of books. So I uh, went on Audible. Now, they did have one book that I could get with my membership. So I got, I downloaded that one, but I haven't started listening to that one yet. I don't know what that's called because I, I can't tell you because it's on my phone. But um, anyway, I found another one the other day and it's called The Stranger. And I've started listening to it. I'm on chapter five. And let me tell you something. It's weird as all get go. Um... It starts off, the first couple of chapters, it starts off kind of slow. And um, uh, at first when I started reading it, I was kind of like, do I really want to listen to this? Because it doesn't sound like it's going to be, you know, worth my time to sit here and listen to it. So I started listening to it. And I decided to just kind of muddle through it and see what, you know, it was about. And it's, it's pretty good so far. Um, it's, it's interesting, I, I have to say. Um, it, it's weird. I'll just put it this way. Anyway, it's about this stranger. And he comes to a baseball field where this man's son is, I guess, trying out for a baseball team, softball, baseball team, one of the two. I'm not, not really sure. I kind of, kind of just, you know, the first couple of chapters, I kind of just, you know, went about not really paying attention. I know that's bad, right? And, um, so anyway, he's the strangers there and he sees the guy and basically he goes up and whispers in his ear to check credit card purchases and tells him that his wife is cheating on him now this guy doesn't know who this man is and let me tell you it's weird I i'm serious so I'm thinking, okay, this is going to be one of those, you know, one of those, you know, suspense books where, yeah, the husband finds out the wife is cheating on, you know, whatever. It's going to be one of those suspense drama, you know, filled, you know, whatever. So I thought, okay, well, now it's just really, really starting to get really strange because, I, when I stopped yesterday, um, I was like, okay, I, I, this is weird. So, but so far, like I said, it starts off slow. The first couple of chapters, you know, are slow. And, but, you know, after that, I'm kind of, and I was like, and I really didn't want to, I was going to just like stop it. I was just going to say, you know what? This isn't an interesting book. I, you know, whatever. But now I really want to know what's going on because this dude, I'm telling you. So, um, yeah, I finished, in, I ended chapter five. Uh, was it yesterday? Was it yesterday? Hold on. We will find out. I can't remember. What, if I ended chapter five, I don't remember. Now, see, I keep a track in my planner. Yes, I am. I'm, I'm weird that way. Um, and of course, I didn't write down write that down. So I want to say, um, 
Hmm. I want to say I stopped at chapter five on Tuesday. Now I'm going to, I'm going to, you know, continue to listen to it because I mean, it's a really, 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 um, good, um, book so far. And, um, um, it's pretty, pretty good. So we'll see. I'm kind of excited about it. Cause I want to know what it's about. So we'll see. Um, and I'll let you know how that's going. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, let's see what else. That's the only book I've been reading. I have, uh, another book that I read that I keep, you know, and so I can read in bed, but I haven't been reading in bed. <sighs> Don't know why. It's just like every time I go in there to, with the intention. Yeah, it doesn't happen. So I'm going to try to pick that back up because I have a book that's sitting there on the end table that I need to read. So anyhow, but, uh, that's really all that, um, update on that point. I have finally started getting, uh, the, 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 the getting ready to paint. I'll be ready to do that this weekend. Thank God. Cause my poor, my poor apartment and, um, I needed, now I don't know what they call it, but Miranda's boyfriend called it a roller cover for the roller, the paint roller. So now I have one. So now I can, um, you know, get that started so I can, uh, get, uh, started on the painting because I need to my apartment oh my gosh the walls need to be painted and I like I you know those of you that you know watch my diamond painting videos also I had um said excuse me that I was going to start painting in around Christmas now mind you I did I did in the bathroom. I started, you know, I did all the around the the ceiling and the wall, the corners and so forth. And that's about as far as I got because I didn't have the right size uh, thing for the roller. So now that I do, yes, it only took me, you know, however many months to get a new one. But now that I do, I'm going to... Um, work on that this weekend because I am so ready for uh, a new paint job in the apartment. And, um, whoops, where did it go? Out oh, there. So, yeah. And, I mean, we finally got some stuff done around here, organized. Um, Justin cleaned his room out, and that was an experience. Let me tell you, that was fun not this poor boy i'm telling you i don't know what he did and why he does this but when he's done his closet no lie guys his closet was full of clothes and you know i i asked both of them i said why and you know skyler looked at me he's like because you're not in my clothes um, okay. And so, you know, I'm sitting here and I'm thinking, really? I mean, this thing, this closet was full of clothes and I couldn't figure out what in the, really? Really? Okay. Why? <laughs> this isn't funny. I go to, I'm telling you, um, couldn't figure out why and I asked him he's like well first he tried to tell me it was because he didn't have a laundry basket in his room to put his dirty laundry and I said son um really he's like what I said uh, okay 
I said, but and of course, you know, by this time, you know, I, and I said, dude, you do have one in here. What do you mean? And I showed him and he was like, oh, I said, so explain to me how, you know, you, I, I, I don't get it. I really don't guys. I don't understand. How is it that, I, I don't know. So anyway, he cleaned it out and I told him once he cleaned it out, we would work on rearranging the living room or rearranging the living room. Holy crap. Rearranging his uh, stuff like his bunk bed because he doesn't have enough. They don't have enough space in there. And now why, you know, there's, you know, they make a big deal about it. I don't know. I think because there's only room for Justin's Xbox and there's not room for Skylar's Xbox. So it's kind of like, you know, one of those things. And so then Justin says, well, we need curtains. And I, I just kind of looked at him. I was like, why are you worried about curtains? And he's like, because, oh, okay. Now, mind you, I, you know, I, I have every intention. I had every intentions of finding curtains for him, but I couldn't figure out the color. And I, you know, was thinking, you know, one color and I threw that out there and they both turned around and said, no. Okay. Well, what color do you want? Well, Justin said black, Skylar said green. Okay. Well, dude, um, okay. I said, well, y'all need to make up your mind. And, you know, Justin's like, well, what's wrong with black? I said, nothing. I said, but it does attract, you know, the heat or whatever. And he just like looks at me and he's like, okay what's wrong with that? I said, nothing. I'm just telling you. So I said, I'm just telling you, in my opinion, I don't think, you know, you having black curtains would be a good idea. I said, cause it'll feel like a darn sauna in here. Like it already does. So they finally agreed on gray. Now as to whether or not that stays at that decision don't know we'll see I haven't got there yet we shall see uh he you know because they 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 will change their mind knowing them they'll change their mind we'll see i don't know i mean i'm will be looking for gray curtains the next time i go to walmart but uh yeah um I'm not going to hold them to that. So, I don't know. We'll see. It just all really, really depends on whether or not they decide to change the color. Now, of course, Scott, the little dude was like, well, we can have one green and one black or one gray and one black. And I just looked at him like, what? So, you want to be mismatched. Okay whatever but you know I got my curtains up so that was all that mattered I hung those up first thing this morning I have to do a couple other things and then I'm good to go for the rest of the day and then I'm gonna sit and um stitch and listen to uh listen to a book and listen and why and have the tv on I always try to listen to a book or listen to a podcast, and I don't get very far. I guess I could do it while I'm doing stuff, but I just, I don't know. I just never get to that point. Don't ask me why. I have no clue. So, I did want to... Huh. I forgot. 
what I was going to say. Oh, my. I don't even remember what I was going to say now. That's bad. Um. Hmm. Little dude's doing good. Those of you that um, are wondering. Yeah, he's doing pretty good. He's um, actually in there right now uh, during, you know, doing his class. And he's, uh, he's been having some problems with getting on, um, you know, his Zoom classrooms, there's a couple of classrooms that he's been uh, not been able to log into and I've had to kind of put a burr under the teachers to get them to kind of resolve the issue a little. And so now he's, you know, able to get in there. Now, my thing is, is he'll probably come out to me this afternoon and say, Mom, I can't get in to, it's always their um, special. And I told him, I said, well, you know, we'll figure it out. And after numerous, you know, messages back and forth, they finally tell him what to do. And it's, it gets annoying, believe me. So, I, um, yeah. So, um, I'm going to cut this short, but I wanted to do this really, really quick. And if you guys like, you know, the Stitch With Me's, please. I wanted to make, you know, bring everybody, I wanted to do these, do these more. I feel like I haven't done it. So, um, I will, you know, if you guys want to see these again, please feel free to let me know. And, um, but I wanted to do this really, really quick to kind of, you know, see what, uh, if anybody, you know, liked them or what, because I feel like I don't do enough stitching floss tube or whatever on my channel. So anyway, I hope everyone has a great day. Thank you for watching this mini stitch with me. And I promise I'll do it longer <laughs> next time. So until then, guys, have a great week.